What's up guys, Mystic Fire here to bring you Black Clover Chapter 167, The Road to Revenge and Atonement. Uh, you know, a lot of people were expecting, including myself, to this chapter to be, you know, like action-packed. Because, you know, Raid and Sally and Baltus, they were the enemy, you know, they were in cahoot with uh, the Adam and I son. And... We unexpectedly did not get that, which was very surprising, which I really liked because it was like the episode of, not the episode, the chapter of Come Before the, come before the Storm because they have already reached, they have reached the royal capital where everything's going to go down. So they have reached the battlefield where the climax of the entire story is going to just collide into one single fight. Now, uh, the way this chapter began is with Ray Talon Bottles going to talk to the Black Bulls and we see the lineup that is there ready to fight them three already, which is Asta, Makana, um, Charmy, Luck, yeah, that's it, I mean, the, the rest, they were in the base, Henry was there in the base and whatnot, uh, and so... You know, negotiations, everything was about negotiation in this chapter, which it came out to be natural, like, you know, it came to be funny negotiations, actually, instead of, like, serious negotiations. There were serious negotiations, but the way it was handled, it was comedic, and, you know, and, and I really like that, that it was comedic negotiations instead of, like, an overly serious negotiation chapter. Now, uh, Rates is there saying... That we're gonna use, you know, that we need your powers. You no, know, Ray's actually come up with a great plan uh, uh, to take revenge on Lit. He basically goes and said, Hey, we need your power. Uh, we can take you to the royal capital, no, since you wanna go there anyway. So we have the same goals. Uh, I, I'm annoyed by you, too, by you guys too, but Lit, the one that I wanna kill right now is Lit. Basically, basically Patrick, not a real lick, you know, but they don't know that his name is Patrick, so in that sense, we're seeing it from their point of view instead of, um, it's instead of Patrick's point of view, I, I guess, I, I should say like that, I don't know. Uh, yeah, no, and Asa says, no, nobody's gonna do that because they have, for one, they have heard people, you know, especially Ray's, he attacked the royal capital. And he heard a lot of people, and I was just like, "That's not gonna, that's not gonna go away." Uh, Sally was snapping kids to suck out their magic, not her, but you know, to order. And then Baltos was also involved in the real capital attack. Uh, so in that sense, you know, and Asta has his own type of binding, binding restraining magic, and it's called Asta Grapple. So yeah, I know it looks like Asta was watching a lot of wrestling, uh, a lot of wrestling recently. And he has done a lot of moves, you know, he did a lot of moves on Raid. Uh, because, you know, Asta did not want to go with Raid's plan. So he just, he, he basically came up with his own plan. And it actually worked. He got Sally and Baltus on his side. Baltus just wants to confirm everything that Raid told him that it was true. You know, that Lick actually betrayed them. And, every, and if everything that Lick told him was a lie, that he has to... I tell him for his crimes because he's he's really a criminal. You know, he thought he was doing this for for the righteousness, which which in that in a way that was uh, Patrick's goal all along. And you know, so now um, Sally wants to just keep doing more experiments. And you know, the only reason why she joined Leg was because Leg promised her that she could do all the experiments she could because the Magic Knights wouldn't allow her to do so. So in that sense, you know, now now Asta Asta came with the uh, with the idea of like, hey, you want you wanted to study my body, right? Then I'll give you permission to study once you say once you save the country, you know. But they still have to talk for the crimes, you know, because because you know if that would have been the case when it comes to Niche, he would have he would have just joined the Black Bulls right there and then, or become Asta's friend right there and then, instead of going to jail and paying for his crimes which is what he's doing right now in the manga. So uh, they're going to also do the same thing. Uh, and next arc will serve as the Atonement arc, you know, in a, in, in a sort of way. Plus, uh, so, plus Charmy with her food, you know, Charmy with her food, Chia basically brought all three of them to their side because Rage was, Rage was the only one that didn't want to 
follow Asta's pace when it comes to these agreements. Uh, and Asta's agreement was basically, all right, so we're going to go to the royal capital. We're going to help the people there. You're not going to hurt anybody. Just hurt, just help the people, you know, and help save the country. And Rich said no to that. Stalin said yes to that only because Asta promised to be her guinea pig as well as if she if she helps uh, if her research is to helping people you know a lot of people could allow her could basically allow themselves to be guinea pigs as well for her um Bosses, on the other hand just he just wants to confirm uh, he just confirmed that Lick actually betrayed them you know he's he 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 actually thinks he's a criminal if Lick actually you know if Lick actually everything looks everything that Patrick said was a lie you know he thinks of as a criminal, so he's gonna pay for his crimes in that in that way. So the only one here, the thing he, is, he's in the right age rate. Now people want uh, all three of them to join the Black Bulls. Uh, that's not gonna happen because for once they're terrorists, and for even though Yami, you know, takes people that have been thrown over society, he's not gonna take he's he's not gonna take terrorists to the to the team, especially because of everything that they have done. And if you think about it, if Batu joins the Black Bulls, then um, Pharaoh becomes useless because, you know, Batu can basically do both. Batu is a special magic, uh, you know, and he has a lot more magic than Pharaoh in that sense because he could transport the Black Bulls base along with the people in there over a long distance, which Pharaoh always runs out of magic. Pharaoh cannot attack, you know, he's not offensive. He's not an offensive special magic like his brother, while... Uh, Baltos can attack and also teleport people. So in that sense, you know, Fenrir becomes useless. Even though he's in, even though he is in, in a coma right now, it doesn't really matter. You, it would just make Fenrir become useless. Sadly, on the other hand, she could possibly join the Black Bulls, but I doubt if she will, because she could be used as, uh, she could be used as a plot point later on in the story to go to the Diamond Kingdom, you know, because, you know, the Diamond Kingdom is all about research, and she is a researcher, she does experiments, so, and Diamond Kingdom is known for their experiments, and, you know, and their scientific technology and whatnot, so, in that sense, it, it could be used as a plot point later on to go to the Diamond Kingdom instead of, you know, instead of focusing on the Diamond Kingdom by itself when it comes to Mars, because, you know, the entire, the entire Black, Black Clover story revolves around Asta. Even though Asta isn't really the focus all the time, it revolves around Asta and the way he, check, he checks the world up, you know. So, uh, let me see what else is there. They reach the cat, they reach the, the, um, the real capital and it needs all destroyed. The only thing that is remaining it is the, uh, the palace. And the palace, you know, the palace might my fault because Licht, the real Licht, is going there. Patrick is already going there, and all and every other elf is every other elf is already going there too. So there's gonna be the big showdown. Now we haven't really seen the royal family or anything. We we do see so we saw some royal magic knights or some royals uh, or some nobles. I don't know if they were magic knights or what now. Um, when the black boots arrived, so in that sense, I don't I don't know. But we just gotta we just gotta wait and see what's gonna happen next week's uh, next week's chapter. Uh, I'm expecting action. If not action, then we're gonna see a, a, a different point of view when it comes to you know, or even Nasa, because Nasa might be fighting already in that in the palace since they were going there to protect the king. Uh, so you know they might be there. If not, we're gonna see like how Nasa and Noel and uh, the other Magina react to finding about. Uh, Julius being dead, you know, that he was murdered by Patrick. When it comes to that, Nelson is going to become a lot more, he's going to feel a lot more hatred towards Patrick or Lick because, you know, they, they still don't know who he really is, so they all know him about Lick. So he's going to feel a lot more hatred towards Patrick, just like Yami, and we might even see a Yami and, no, and Nelson team up against Lick because Lick uses like magic, and now, now that he has his body back, or he has his soul back, he 